Here's how to fix Call of Duty Black Ops 7 lag or stuttering or FPS drops on PC. In only 3 steps. So let's get started. To do the first step, all you have to do is just go ahead and right click on this PC. Then go down and click on properties. Now guys, all you have to do is just go ahead and click on advanced system settings. Then click on settings and then check this option. Adjust for best performance. Go down and click on apply and then ok. Then guys, to do the second step, go back to the windows settings click on gaming just go ahead and turn off game bar and then turn on game mode go back to the settings again and now just go ahead and search for power options or power and sleep settings click on power and sleep settings and then click on additional power settings from right over here now guys you should be able to see the option called high performance on right over here if you have pc uh, you should be able to see this option just go ahead and check this option and if you have laptop, just go down on your desktop, uh, click on battery icon from tax bar, and then you can change power mode from right over here. Uh, all you have to do is just go ahead and change power mode to the best performance or high performance. Go back to the Windows settings again, and now all you have to do is just go ahead and type graphic settings on right over here. Then just go ahead and turn on this option, then click on browse, locate a uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 7 install location, select Call of Duty um, Black Ops 7 icon or shortcut and then go down and click on add. When you add uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 7 to the right over here and turn on this option, all you have to do is just go ahead and restart your PC. Now there is only one more step to fix this issue. To do the last step, all you have to do is just go ahead and update your graphic card driver. If you have NVIDIA graphic card, just go ahead and download GeForce Experience or NVIDIA app and then you should be able to update your uh, graphic card driver from GeForce Experience. And if you have AMD or Intel graphic card, just go ahead and search on your web browser, uh, go to the AMD or Intel website and then you should be able to update your graphic card driver. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Please go ahead and subscribe my YouTube channel. Peace out.